Hey gang, it's John Horn and I was asked to do the uh, video uh, for Amazing Grace demonstrating the finger picking pattern. I know I uh, said I would post it and I didn't do that yet, so let me get that taken care of right now. Um, I'm capoed at my third fret. We're playing Amazing Grace in the key of A and I'm going to angle my guitar this way so hopefully you can get a good look at the right hand as best as we can get it. Maybe I'll scoot up even a little further. So what's happening is the thumb is, this is on an A chord to start off with, the thumb is playing the fifth string, middle finger, M playing the second, and you might want to just kind of warm up, making sure you've got those two down, and then we're going to move to the two inside strings, fourth string with the thumb, third string with the index finger, all right? Now that much, you've only got two beats, you got one and two and, that's the same finger picking we did earlier in the semester. So to make it 3-4, we just repeat those middle two notes a second time. So it's 1 and 2 and 3 and 1, 2, 3. And the most important thing about it that makes it sound like it's in 3-4 time is the thumb. I kind of think of a tuba going oom-pa-pa, oom-pa-pa. song. A couple of little things when you go to the second chord in the song is the D. Everything is the same. You just move it up a set of strings. So now you're on your fourth, middle finger on the first, and then your third string with the thumb, second string or B string with the index finger. So top four strings, thumb, middle, thumb, index, thumb, index. All right, then you're going to go back to A for the next couple bars of the song. To the E chord and eventually the E7 chord. It's exactly the same as the A, except your first note is the low E, obviously, the sixth string. So it's sixth string, then second, fourth, third, fourth, third. And when you do E7, just lift that ring finger out, kind of making a big deal out over here so you can see it. All right? So you can practice all of those individually, of course, just to make sure group of strings in the right hand to the other is not too difficult for you. And then just start putting it all together. So take your time with it. I'd rather you get it uh, correct than go fast and play something weird that uh, is not, and not appropriate. So let's see if I can sing it in this key. it so pretty easy um, don't think of this as a final just think of it as one more step on our path through the year um, maybe there will be a more exciting final at the end um, for many of you there will be the last part of the GSP so we have that to look forward to uh, if I don't run into you around the building have a great break and I look forward to seeing you next semester take care bye bye